Okay, uh, here's one of my uh, first modifications uh, for the uh, trailer. I got a, a piece of uh, white um, fence post at, uh, hang on, at um, Lowe's. Looks like this white PVC fence post square, four inches. And I went ahead and I measured um, out where I was going to install this. In this particular case, I can only install it on the the bumper. I don't want to put the hose, this is for the uh, sewer waste by the way, uh, inside the bumper. I've seen um, bumpers rust out because of residual water and whatnot. Um, so I got this piece of plastic, I'm just going to mount it on top of it. Um, but anyway, I um, cut it down to size. I got some uh, in caps, spray painted them, put a screw on the top, screw on the bottom, drilled some holes for ventilation and water that may drip out. On this side here, I got a little hinge, screwed it down, and it will open up like this for when I want to stuff my hose inside and uh, all the other compartments. So um, that's what it looks like right now. It is drying, I just painted it again. Um, and in a few minutes, we'll go ahead and we'll install it. I'm going to install it by these, uh, uh, you know, wrapping these around the bumper and um, the PVC and screwing it into the bumper. Uh, so strapping it down basically with three straps like that. Okay, so we'll take a look at that in a few minutes. Okay, uh, there it is installed. Uh, on the top, that's the uh, sewer hose um, storage and got a little lip right here that pops up and uh, painted the black to match the bumper so that is it for modification number one to the trailer a four foot sewer storage uh, pipe storage area